This is LEGO Star Wars set 7203 from 2002. This one's called the uh, Jedi Defense one. The other one is a uh, Jedi Defense with uh, Obi-Wan, not Obi, this is Obi-Wan, with a uh, Qui-Gon Jinn and two other battle droids. If you can see on the back of the box here, you can see there's a Qui-Gon Jinn. You get the door with the next one. Number two, you get that battle droid and that battle droid. The Rudge Rudge ones, and we'll just have a quick look at the box, why not now? See, so you got the uh, movie scene, you can see a young Ewan McGregor, um, and uh, the Battle Droids from the movies, I really like that they have these on the boxes, I would like them nowadays, if they did the same, but I don't think they'll ever do that again, but cool. So we'll check out the minifigures first, you got, of course, an Obi-Wan Padawan, you can see, like, with all the J at the stage, you had the shiny lightsabers, cape, and if you look to here, you got the uh, Jedi braid, the, uh, the Padawan braid there, and yeah, the uh, face is actually quite a little bit common for this end. The uh, Luke Skywalker has the uh, exact same face, but he's got a very blonde eyebrow, so these are brown. And you can see, yeah, he's got his little belt, it's quite cool, quite detailed, it's more detailed than a lot of newer figures, that's what I find interesting. And then you get the um, two battle droids, they're the exact same, and they're where the big piece count for this set come in. There's 59 pieces, and yeah, you only get the two battle droids. There's no like you know little build to go with it. It's just these two battle droids. But I actually prefer these battle droids compared to the new ones because the new ones I find are a bit weird and they don't really look like they're movie accurate. For some reason, I find these ones look a tiny bit more movie accurate. Yep, yeah, to me, may not maybe to you, but I really prefer these ones. They're quite cool. Of course, you get the two things. Maybe because I. Because if you played like the Lego Star Wars games, they look a bit more like this. Maybe that's why I prefer them or not. But yeah, they're really quite cool, really simple build. And yeah, it goes with a lot. Again, these were only seven bucks all up in the day. So of course you got the instructions. Like they're the same as if you're watching my other videos. You got the um, the uh, final duel one and two, and then you got the um, Jedi defense. And yeah, obviously you know this where the movie scenes from. It's from the uh, episode one when uh, Obi-Wan and Qui-Gon go to the uh, Droid Federation ship to find, like, to discuss Pete's steal for Naboo, and it, yeah, obviously they have to reverse droids, and basically kicks off the Clone Wars. Not really kicks off, that's when cloned, but starting off, like, the war. So, yeah, so there's not much more I can really say about the set. Obviously, it's old, vintage, um, it's really funny with, like, vintage, because... It's 2002, I get it, it's 20 years ago, but still not too vintage, it's not like it's, you know, first Lego coming out, but still classifies as vintage, because, yeah, Lego, Lego time's different. But yeah, cheers, thanks for watching, check out my other videos, um, like, subscribe, and yeah, cheers, thanks, bye.